Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to be unboxing the August Owl Crate box. So um, if you watched my last Owl Crate unboxing, the July one, I did say that I wasn't sure whether I would be getting Owl Crate this month just because of money reasons, but I did kind of think about it and I knew there was an exclusive Eleanor and Park item in here and because it is my favourite standalone novel, I knew I wouldn't be able to get whatever it is that's in here anywhere else and I just thought technically this is once in a lifetime opportunity to get something that I'm probably going to really love and I'm probably going to really love everything else that's in this box too so do you know what I'm just going to get it but this probably will be the last owl crate unboxing I do for a little while because it's from Canada and therefore it's quite expensive to ship to me I may still get some of the um, UK based subscription boxes so I possibly will still get the nerdy bookworm box and the fairy loot box and any other really cool um, upcoming book subscription boxes that I find that are UK based I may still get those and do unboxings for those but Owl Crate I think I will give a rest for a little while just because I need to start saving some money um, I do have a job and I am earning money but I think you know it's getting a little bit silly really <laughs> obviously I'm buying books and I'm buying subscription boxes and you know I do need to save some money so yeah anyway let's get into the box the theme for this month was fast times at YA high which obviously is incredibly incredibly exciting for those of us that like high school stories so I'm in I'm into the box and right here I see this spoiler card with this really cute illustration of obviously a high school hallway with the lockers and it's got the owl crate banner and um yeah i mean wouldn't you just want to be there i do anyway so <laughs> let's see what we have we have all of these normal kind of white paper squiggles but i'm now getting absolutely everywhere first thing i see is a really cute pin and i love pins if you follow me on instagram you will know how much i love pins and this one says hogwarts is my home which it most certainly is so that is going straight on my bag and i'm really really loving that absolutely love the colors and the font on that as well it's just lovely i also see another pin in here which says chapter raptor with a little raptor reading a book how cute is that well, my my bag just got two new pins and that's really, really exciting. Next we have this little um this little blue drawstring bag with owl crate on the front. How cute is that? And I think this is the Eleanor and Park item. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's so cute. This was basically the reason I got this box, let's be real here. I'm gonna open it. I think it's a necklace i think it's a really cute necklace yeah it is oh god it's gorgeous oh i love it it's one of those long ones that you can wear with anything that i love and it's got eleanor and park there and then it's got this little gold mixtape how cute is that oh i love it and apparently this is exclusive so like i don't know where this is from and i don't know who if you know whatever company made it i don't know if they are selling it anywhere else because our crate did say that it was exclusive to them so oh it's gorgeous i love it i love it this box was worth it whatever the book is whatever the rest of it this box was worth it because i love that and i will definitely wear that so that's awesome i also see this little decomposition notebook in here and it's got um so that it's got the solar system so it's got all the planets there uh great sphinx of giza so it's a little kind of like um you know like a little high school notebook that they give you with them um, you know points of reference and things so that's cute and then it's got what is behind the stars little diagram of a garden and and obviously it's a diagram of soy i guess so yeah i really really like that it's very kind of vintagey very cute little lined notebook what else is in here we have a gorgeous again this is for my bedroom wall i love getting things for my bedroom wall it's this gorgeous illustration of harry ron and hermione in the classroom and it kind of illustrates their characters all so well so you've got hermione putting her hand up knowing all the answers we've got harry looking slightly bored and then we have ron who is fast asleep i adore that that's that's just gorgeous some very very talented person made that so yeah 
I also see this little promotion for Rainbow Rowl. The problem with picking up a Rainbow Rowl book is eventually you have to put it down. This is true. And it's got on the back, find what you need in a Rainbow Rowl novel. Wow, so it's just basically promotion for Rainbow Rowl in general. See, it's got um, quotes from Eleanor and Park, Fangirl and Carrie on there. So you've got the Eleanor and Park quote, she looked like art and art wasn't supposed to look nice, it was supposed to make you feel something. Lovely, lovely Rainbow quote there. From Fangirl it says, to really be a nerd she decided you had to prefer fictional words to the real one. Again, very true. And from Carry On, which I haven't read, but it's very high on my TBR list, it says, you were the sun and I was crashing into you. So, I mean, that's just, a, it's literally just a card with Rainbow Row love. So, I, I love that. I do. So, yeah. I need to stop saying yeah, you know, after everything, because I've realised I do that in, like, literally all my videos, and it's probably really irritating, so I'm very, very sorry. Um, What else is in here? It's an adult colouring book, because if I don't have enough of these already, I have so many adult colouring books. But this one says stress relieving patterns. So it's just a nice little general pattern-y one. And I will definitely enjoy getting my pencils on to that. So, yeah, it says it's got 48 patterns to colour. And, yeah, that will go with my other adult colouring books, because I do have quite a few. What else is in here? I think we only have the book left. So let's see what it is. It is P.S. I Like You by Casey West. I've never heard of this book. Um, I have heard of Casey West, though. Um, so I know she writes um, YA Contemporary. I don't know anything about this book, though. I have no idea what it's about. Um, it's also got some, um, I guess they're like colouring pencils to go with the um, colouring book. So the little teeny tiny ones. And as always, we have a letter from the author of the book. And um, I guess that's her signature. So that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, this is the book. Let me know if you have heard of this book or... Um, you know, if you enjoyed it, if you've read any other Casey West, I know she is quite popular with um, American and Canadian and um, basically non-British booktubers. So, um, yeah, I mean, I am intrigued. I'm guessing, obviously, it's a YA high school film, um, book, film, what is a film? Um, it's a YA high school book, um, obviously, because it's in this unboxing. So, um, yeah, I mean, I am, as I said, I am intrigued. So, if I um, read it, I will obviously um, talk about it with you guys and obviously you will um, get my opinion and my thoughts on it. So, yeah. And that is it for um, this month's Owlcrate unboxing. Did you get this week, this month's Owlcrate? Um, let me know um, if you enjoyed all of the contents in the book. I, I am losing my words. This is ridiculous and I can't refilm this because this is an unboxing so yeah um also just a reminder that my um, giveaway for this savage song um by Victoria Schwab is ending um on Friday which I think will be tomorrow but if I don't post this until Friday it will be tonight it ends at midnight GMT on August the 19th so um if you are interested, then you will have to get in quick for that. Watch that video to find out how to enter. Obviously, I will leave all my social media in the description down below. I hope you're having an awesome day and I will see you very soon for another video. Bye-bye.